Andy and Sue Cogswell are readying their daughter Kelly for her afternoon medicine. Kelly doesn't look it, but she is almost four years old. Her growth was slowed by a debilitating disease called mitochondrial. Sue is not only a concerned parent, but a registered nurse as well. In mitochondrial disease, obviously, the mitochondria don't work very well. Um, and when they don't work, they are not able to give the food and oxygen to the cell that the cell needs. So the mitochondria die, which means the cell dies with it. And as cells die, different organ systems in the body um, start to die also. Diagnosed at a year old, Kelly's doctors gave her only three to four months to live. She had such brain damage and it showed that she had several strokes. Uh, and he said it looked very bad. It looked very progressive. And from that day on, at a year old, she would just be going downhill. Almost three years later, Sue calls Kelly her miracle baby. But it hasn't been an easy road. Recently, their insurance company reduced Kelly's at-home nursing care. Now Sue has to set her alarm several times in the middle of the night to make sure Kelly gets her medicine on time. Not only has Kelly's disease affected the emotional fiber of this family, but their finances as well. She has more than outgrown her old wheelchair um, and insurance companies have been trying to save money um, and it's been very difficult. In South River, Karen DePodwin, Fios One News.